Hello, this is Cindy. Welcome to my channel. And this is Fabulous Friday. Um, so, yeah, I've been working on making master boards this past, most of this morning. And um, I thought, you know, it would be a lot of fun just to make the master boards. And then what I've done is I, I made one for a nature journal. I have two for my pink and green journal. I have uh, for my, these would be for my book journal. And this is for another, uh, for a nature journal, a different nature journal. So I have all of these pieces. The book journal is one that will be for sale when I finish it. Uh, it is still in process. But I thought, you know, I might as well just turn my camera on as I finish decorating these just to have a little bit of a play. So if you have a master board that you have done and now you have to decorate it, you know, you look at this and it's there's so much going on. It is it is definitely got a lot of um, activity. And so I tend to calm the activity down just a little bit with some tissue paper. And I'm going to go ahead and cut this down just a little bit more because it's a little bit big. But this is just gift wrap tissue paper. It comes in lots of different colors and I put all of my scraps down. That scrap that I just took off of here, I won't, I'm not throwing that away. That'll go in my bag. There we go. And now I'll have it. This, these are the little scraps. I will show you the big scraps or the big pieces. I have, it doesn't even fit on camera. It, this is an, a 12 by 12, one of those bins that just, you know, you, people do projects and put projects in them. I, this is stuffed to the gills with tissue paper of every color. Every time somebody gives us or gives me a present, gives my husband a present, whatever, I have a tendency to take the tissue paper and go, ooh, new color, new color for my bin. So I have all sorts of different, what the heck? Oh, that's from a, picked, didn't, that's the problem with those stickers is that they have these ends on them and then you don't know where they end up because they're clear. So we'll put this, this has already got a cut edge, so or a straight edge, so we're gonna put that right up against the edge there. And we'll put that down. And all that does is kind of mute some of the busyness. You could still see everything underneath it, but the busyness is a little bit less. Now I have these large stickers that a friend of mine gave me, and I really like how that looks. So I'm going to go ahead and use that. I used obviously one on an, one of the other ones, and that's where that piece of plastic came from that I was that was in my way. Now the only problem. These are not that hard to get started. You just have to pull the front from the back. That's the thing to remember when you're dealing with stickers. Pull the front from the back. And I use the tape to kind of stabilize the back a little bit, give me a little bit more to hang on to. Okay, it's not quite as even as I'd like it to be, but it's all right. It's not awful. We'll put our little bird there. And then I want to put, I think, a flower. Let me grab a daisy. Let's see what we have in the way of daisies. I want, you know what? I'm not sure if I want a daisy or if I want a butterfly. Do I want a daisy? Oh, those are pretty. Maybe I want a daisy and a butterfly. So just going to decorate these up. I hope you're having a great Friday. And the day that I'm filming this, it is windy here in the Finger Lakes. We have a high wind warning. We're going to, winds are going to be 20 to 40 miles an hour with gusts up to 60. So it's going to be a blustery day in a little while. Right now it's not too bad. Every once in a while we get a little gust, but not awful. I don't really like how that looks there. So maybe we can... You know what? We're going to take that green down a little bit. And we're going to 
make this into a tag so we don't have quite so much green that's up there. I don't mind the green. It's anti-establishment green. And um, I always wanted an anti-establishment green dune buggy. I know most of you don't know what a dune buggy is. Go watch uh, the computer wore tennis shoes, any of those. I loved the dune buggies. Of course, I'm madly in love with Kurt Russell, so what difference does it make? All right. Um, yeah, that still needs something. We're going to hold off on that one. So for this one, I want this one for my book journal because it's very similar to the right colors. I'm going to cut it down just a little bit. It's a little wide and a little bit tall. So let me just pull this this way. It might still be too tall. Yeah. All right. Um, tissue, paper, paper, pfft, tissue paper has a definite grain to it. Um, it's easy to, to go in one direction. It is not so easy to go in the other. Just keep that in mind as you're tearing tissue paper. When I do master boards, this is the way I do them. I, I make them up, and um, then when I cut them up, I usually calm down, depending upon how busy they are. You know, if I'm doing a book page one, I don't necessarily put the tissue paper down. But if I have all of these colors... I just need to calm it somewhat. It's a little bit busy. I think this is a sticker. Not entirely sure if this is a sticker or just, this is one that was gifted in Happy Mail. It might just be, hang on. I'm gonna get my, put a little bit of tape there and see what happens. Oh, yep, it is a sticker. I can't get a, get it. There we go. There we go. I'll put my, I, I love this guy. He's absolutely adorable. What a cute little penguin. And then we're going to distress the edge of this a little bit. We're going to stress the whole thing in a minute. But right now, this says, if you don't like to read, you haven't found the right book. And it's a quote by J.K. Rowling. And I think it's just a little bit bigger than I want. There we go. Take that over here. There we go. if I want to. Eh, that's all right. You know what? We'll fix it in a minute in a different way because it hangs off the edge just a little bit. But I don't want to cover up his cute little cowlick. So there we go. If you don't like to read, you haven't found the right book. And then we'll just trim off those little extra pieces. There. That looks all right. Now, do I want to turn this into a tag or do I want to do this as a rounded corners? I think I want rounded corners. I'm going to do the big one because my little one does not do the heavier weighted. Now that I've got all these layers on there, my smaller corner rounder doesn't like doing all of those layers. So I have to do the bigger corners. I will look at getting a different corner rounder, but at the moment, this is what we've got. This is what we go with. All right, let's do up those edges. Just a little bit, just enough to take the white off the edge. There. All right. So there's a short video today where I, I will, you know, showing you my, these are, are now for my books. I have three new tags for my books. I have two tags for my pink and green journal, and I have three nature tags. This one needs to be 
edged. Sorry. You know, you guys have got to remind me of this all the time because I always forget. You know that I forget to edge to do the edging. All right, there, that looks better. What it needs is a hole. And I think, ouch, for this one, I just banged my knee on the edge of the table. I'm just going to use a hole punch. And you know, you can get these hole punches at Michael's and you can, or any craft store and you can pay an arm and a leg for them or Joanne's, or you can go to Walmart and pay like a buck and a quarter, uh, maybe a buck and a half, but they're not expensive. I'll grab my pieces here. We'll get a, a little piece of this string that looks so it matches my other ones. This is my, my uh, bin of string. There are all sorts of different colors in there. Uh, so I can, and they're all scraps. They're just, you can't do anything else with them. So they become my, let's put them through the hole and make a tag out of them. There we go. So now I have three nature tags to go with it. All right. If you are enjoying this video, please make sure you hit subscribe and like it. And I think this is Cindy signing off.